After a year on the bench, America's largest wiffle ball tournament returned to Twinsburg. News 5's John Rutter shows us how hundreds of teams turned out for a tournament that benefits youth baseball right here in Northeast Ohio. If you build it, this is just fun. It's like you don't have to worry. It's just wiffle ball. They won't come. Wiffle ball is, it's just a game, but it, it's, it's awesome. And if you host the World Series of wiffle ball, teams will show up. Everybody started probably on a wiffle ball field. And the thing is, that's why we have even grown men still playing it, because it's something that they can continue playing as they get older as well. For the last seven years, the World Series of wiffle ball has helped fund the Twinsburg Baseball League. It was basically a bunch of us sitting at the board, looking at ways to try to find ways to increase our revenue for the league because we knew we needed more field space. And this year, 114 teams turned out to take a shot at the title. It was allowed us to be able to, to raise money to be able to put a field in. It took us about five solid years to raise the money with, with coordination with the city, but we were able to build that field and that, that's what was able to do for that. And now we're looking to hopefully turf one of these fields. That's our goal now is the turf because we live in Northeast Ohio. Teams span across six age groups because you don't have to be a kid to enjoy wiffle ball, but many friendships have been forged on the field at a young age. I've just been playing wiffle ball since like I was six or younger and it's just awesome to be playing it competitively and having fun doing the thing I love. It's baseball in its purest form, but no less challenging. The sliders move more and it's easier to throw crazier pitches at younger ages without a consequence permanently. Hitting bombs, who doesn't love hitting bombs? Reporting for News 5, I'm John Rutter.